Good morning. This is the fourth day of our macadamia planting. We are now marking out the rows and the hop where the trees are going to be planted. Um, to do this, we're using a few tools. First of all, we're using the, the wheel meter, which is marking out every meter. Second of all, we're using a, some lime in this bucket here. Third of all, we're using this nylon rope attached to these two metal pegs. We started on this yesterday and yesterday afternoon marking out rows and we've got a fair bit done um, and fortunately overnight it did not rain, we had a fine night so that was great and we're going to continue on this this morning um, I'll show you in a minute where we've already marked the holes and then we'll get into marking out the next row and putting down the the points the handful of lamb of um, lime for each hole so we're going to take the rope down with the peg down to the other side down the bottom and we'll put it in down there eight meters away from the last marking So we're going to be doing another row, marking out another row down this line again. Um, the spacing we're using all along is 8 metres by 4 metres. So rows 8 metres wide, 8 metres across from each row of tree, and the trees 4 metres apart from each other. It's a fairly old standard sort of spacing. Um, today a lot of people use a lot of new plantings are wider than that, like 9 by 5 or 9 by 10. Um, the issue that I, I, we have here is we don't have a huge amount of land and we want to plant a num fair number of trees so we're going for this older style spacing which will require more work in the future, more pruning and so forth, but it's just it's a compromise we have to make. <laughs> 